guys, it's Daisy, and today I'm bringing you a Black Ops 2 gameplay. We're playing Domination, um, and I was playing in a party with some of my subs and my brother. Um, so today, I wanted to talk about my opinion on Advanced Warfare. I've gotten a lot of questions in the comments about my opinion on what I think of the game. And to be honest, at first, when I first saw the trailer, I didn't really like it, especially because of the way... Uh, the characters kind of jump really high, kind of like uh, the other game, Crisis 3, I think it's called Crisis 3. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but I actually downloaded it, and I've played it, and yeah, <laughs> the jumping in that game is ridiculous. So, that was just the first time I saw the trailer, but as I watched uh, more, you know, videos about the guns, and about uh, all the other perks they have in the game, because Ali A and you know T Martin always um, inform us about what else they have in the games and stuff. And I actually saw the gameplays and stuff that they were posting in Advanced Warfare, and it looked okay. But then I heard that it might have zombies. Possibly, it's not confirmed yet, but possibly if they have zombies, I would be even more excited. I would still probably buy the game, even if I don't like it. I'll still buy the game, try it out for myself because I'm just one of those people who like. For example, in high school, if I wanted to learn something, I would have to um, kind of do instead of just watch and listen. So that's kind of like the same thing. If I want to make sure I like a game, I have to actually play it instead of just watching and listening a gameplay. So when I play it, I probably determine whether I like the game or not, but I have to give it like a few days. Because at first, when I first played Ghost, I was a bit skeptical about it, but as I kept on playing it, you know, I liked it. So, I'm just going to have to get used to it. But, I mean, I don't know. A lot of big Call of Duty channels are saying that it might be, like, one of the greatest Call of Duties ever. But, don't they say that every year? I mean, a lot of people said Ghost was going to be awesome. And most people don't like Ghost. I'm, like, one of the few who, who do like Ghost. And, you know, I get hate every now and then because I think Ghost is good. And people are like, Ghost is horrible. You are just a noob on Black Ops 2, blah, 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 you don't like Black Ops 2, you like that trash ghost. And I'm just like, you know, everyone has an opinion on the different Call of Duties they like. But the thing that interests me most about Advanced Warfare is that they took out Dead Silence. Like, there will be no Dead Silence. And I actually commented on T. Martin's channel, you know, saying that if they don't have Dead Silence anymore, people are going to camp a lot. Because, you know, Dead Silence leads to more sound whoring and when people sound whore they tend to hear footsteps camp in a corner and wait till somebody comes out and that's always the case so i think it, there will be a lot more camping especially since there will be no no more dead silence but at the same time it'll be easier to get kills because you hear enemies but i don't know i'm i'm just like in between right now about advanced warfare but fact is i'm definitely gonna get it and uh it comes out november 4th i think which is like a day before my birthday usually it always comes out on the 5th which is on my birthday so it's really cool but uh, I don't know I, I would probably get it for the PlayStation 3 because as you guys know my husband plays on the PlayStation 4 and I have more friends on the PlayStation 3 there's more people online on PS3 than PS4 but I really wish I can get a PS4 again because I feel like this game was made for the next uh, the next console, you know, the next generation console, and I don't know. I just feel like it would just be fun to, to play it for a little bit. I mean, T. Martin and LEA and all these people are so lucky get they get to play it, you know, firsthand. That way they can know whether they're going to get it or pre-order it and everything. But, um, you know, I played Crisis 3, and I'm really bad at that game, like... I, I just, oh god, I, I, I can't even explain. I'll probably post the gameplay of me playing Crisis 3 because, oh god, it's just like the kill streaks for me, it's, I don't know, it's just so hard to get a kill streak on that game. Or maybe it's because I don't play it very often. But the jumping, if it's going to be like that on, on Advanced Warfare, I know for a fact I'm not going to like it. But, I don't know. Um, that's just my thought on Advanced Warfare. If it's true that there is invisibility in that game, I just think it'll be just worse. It'll make camping worse because I know for a fact people are going to camp. And sorry, my phone is ringing. It's my mom calling me right now. But I have to answer later because I'm doing this commentary. So, 
sorry mom i'm ignoring her calls oh my gosh i'm sorry i'm gonna call her back after this because i called her and she didn't answer me but now she wants to call me no but yeah guys the invisibility i think is gonna just make it worse it's just i i could already see it i could already predict the future like that's so raven like i could see See it people are gonna be camping in corners while they are invisible like how much do you want to bet and the invisibility thing is also in crisis 3 when I was playing it there's like a perk that actually makes you invisible for like I think five seconds and then you're visible again but it's not like to you're not like totally invisible you can kind of still see the outline of the character but you know it's just I don't know how it's gonna be honestly I just have to play it but I will definitely get it if I would have to rate how bad I want Advanced Warfare out of 10, 10 stars, I would have to say like a like a six. It, I'm not. I'm just not really excited for it. You know, if it was like a Modern Warfare four or something, I would have been excited for it a lot because I was hoping that they would make something like uh, Modern Warfare three. I wish they made a Modern Warfare three remake. To be honest, like I, I just miss the good old call of duty days when everything was so simple and now everything is so futuristic but i'll just give it a shot anyways because i mean i have no choice i'm into call of duty and unless i buy like grand theft auto 5 which i want to do really badly because i want to get another game but anyways guys hopefully you like this commentary and i'll be posting some more gameplays probably crisis 3 so you guys can see how bad i am at that game but yeah, guys, hopefully you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. So, bye, guys. Have a good day. I did bad. Objective parameters obtained. Well done. Maybe I'm harder set up than I'm gonna win now.